Welcome, Taurus, to Expression Personnel Tarot. Spirit, please help guide this message for Taurus. This is a general reading, Taurus. Everything happens for a reason. So welcome. Timeless reading. Take what resonates, leave the rest behind. So we have the Four of Swords and the Nine of Wands. Some of you really just want to relax after a hard day's worth of work. Some of you have just, you know, found things quite challenging. The challenging aspects. Some of you have been just pretty much tired of having to stand up. It's like, it reminds me, you gotta fight for your right. But it's sure in a party, I'll tell you that here. It's people, it almost looks as if you, you or someone around you keeps like spouting orders off and it kind of is like making you look like, or someone around you look kind of throw it off a little bit there with that four of swords, like chill out, man. But here, here you go. You're arguing with people that you really don't know here. And maybe potentially some of them just. It, it looks just like you. You're like, man, I, I feel like I'm on my own. Like nobody is listening to me. And I see where you're frustrated here. But nonetheless, there's going to be a victory. It's going to be possible. Things will start becoming more abundant for you. More flowy here after some rest. Like, you'll get over the hump. <laughs> you'll get over this hump. So it's like, now let's try. Y'all just do what the, you know, just do whatever I say. <laughs> I said no, not last week. <laughs> and yeah, so there, right when you think that you had things like right on track and things are going smooth, boom, everything falls apart. Something becomes illuminated. Something. Some kind of change, a failing romance, just just broken pieces, man. Broken pieces like something's not going to work. Oh, uh-uh. It's like you're going to go right over there. You're going to find out. Failing romance. Somebody's leaving. Somebody's leaving. Can't make it up. Somebody's stability here is being shook in Taurus. Trying to hold it all together. Yeah. Whatever contract you had, you pulling that back. Any more negotiating here? There ain't no more being patient. You don't see that your partner is enough there. There's something here. There's work related. It could be anything, but you're dependable. You can you can make something else happen, Captain. You can make it happen. You don't need it. You might even be bored with the the current situation. You need some psychological healing. <laughs> I just, I see this whole aspect kind of just being strengthened overall with that, that temperance card. It's like saying be patient. Patience is a virtue. There's some kind of 
firm standing here. It's like it's done. It's a done deal. It is a done deal. It's like where once you're you're not even lost or sad. You're just like, thank God I got out of that situation before, you know. Yep, and I definitely see you here with the chariot in reverse. This is something that you don't find very dependable, and I see you moving on alone. It's almost like it's just not making the progress that that was offered. It's not dependable, and you've thought quite a lot before you walked into this situation, it looks like, and it looks like... Now it's like taking, it's like you're going to take a trip, find out something. It ain't going to make you too, too happy when it becomes illuminated. I'm going to tell you that. Whatever this truth is, it's definitely going to be like, it, it, it it's, <laughs> It is the complete be-all, end-all breakdown here with that Mars energy, Mars Scorpio energy, uh, Aries Scorpio, uh, period, Mars energy. There is a potential for success going at it alone. I see you just wanting to work for yourself here. I see some of you even working from home, work from home jobs there with the seven of pentacles. There's, there's some kind of clear cut decision, new beginning with that, that ace of swords. Yeah, it looks like you're going to possibly go into business for yourself, Taurus, or you're enlightened with a, a pursuit there. Something where you're very quick thinking, but at the same time, you don't want everybody to know your business. Because, and you're like just, you're going to be, be able to use the resources around you there. Some of you might not have been as healthy. You've been at home, uh, Queen of Cups. Uh, make sure, you know, you are, you know, taking care of yourself, caregiving, uh, you know, the medicines that you need and stuff that the doctors, you know, the different therapies out there. Um, I see some of you, uh, lavender sages, diff different, um, sensual senses, um, Florida water even. Make sure you're just taking care of yourself. Partnerships here. Gemini energy. Yeah. Yeah, whatever news that you, you've received after the situation ends here. You're going to reach, it looks like, take what resonates. I don't know if this is going to be for everybody, this one, but um, definitely might be here. With your partnerships, Mercury energy, and we got the three of swords in reverse here. I'm seeing definite, definitely Mercury energy again, Gemini energy. Um, you're going to be receiving some news, uh, King of Wands, Leo energy. There's going to be something very energetic coming from possibly a business partner. Someone just really causing drama. So I do feel as if you are going to be enlightened about someone causing drama. So there is going to be some transformation. There's going to be some order and power that's going to be able to help you to take charge before you... Um, fall into any kind of 
uh, drama. So as soon as you hear word of something, you're going to be able to change whatever situation it is. If, if you're moving or anything, you will be able to take charge. I do see things um, helping you out of a situation to give you this uh, brand new beginning here. Okay, um, with the Ace of Cups in reverse, I see some of you kind of having like that, that spiritual breakdown. A lot of you need to have more hope and faith. There, we do have the holidays coming with the Four of Wands, okay? And I see a lot of you are like, oh my God, I can't lose a job. But I see overall where things are going to be just quite happy. You'll be very happy. You're going to be able to reach obtainable goals. But if you are... If you are not taking that leap of faith right now, I don't see where that things are going to be too happy. I see where it's actually going to leave you in a very controlled situation. Uh, it's going to drain you physically. And a lot of you could really use a holiday at this time. <laughs> I see some of you actually doing some work within the home, possibly repairs. Those look like you're going to be completing a lot of things, um, getting ready for the holidays here. And I, I, do, I do see overall where you're going to be happy, even though it will be somewhat draining, but you'll get through it. Anyway... Thank you so much for joining me, Taurus. Yeah, subscribe to my channel and uh, yeah, let's get over the hump. <laughs>